So it's pretty wet, right? <laughs> Across Australia. I mean, uh, on Monday I'm supposed to be flying back home to the farm to drench my sheep and also um, shoot some footage for a doco uh, that I'm doing. Can't get in because Maury's flooded and Maury being the nearest airport, so kind of stuck here. So a lot of lot of uh, plans have been thwarted for a lot of people, I'm sure. Um, one of the other things that's been thwarted for me is down here in northwest Sydney where I've got my dog training facility. Um, well, trying to build my dog training facility, we've got so much rain that I haven't actually been able to put in a lot of the stuff. There's uh, over the back here, which you can just see maybe. Um, that's where I'm putting in the, the pool for the dock dogs, uh, just over the other side there. I'm putting in uh, yards for herding and tribal and all that sort of stuff. Anyway, because of course it's so wet, we can't get tractors in, etc, etc, etc. So, few issues. However, in the dog yards all along here, we've got quite a few dog yards, uh, we can't mow the grass. So whilst the sheep are unemployed because they're not doing the herding and the mowers can't get in here, I thought, hmm, maybe we could get the sheep to mow the grass. And they're doing it perfectly because of course, so much water, wheels don't work, but sheep don't mind the fact that this grass is, as you can see, turning into a massive forest. Um, they don't get bogged. So you can see the little darlings are doing a perfect job. And of course, unlike lawnmowers that uh, leave edges along the side, because they, they can't get quite to the edge, sheep do a perfect job of the entire lot. You've got to love these sheep. Organic lawnmowers. <laughs> I, could, I could actually make a business out of this. But yeah, there's all my little darlings. And you, you might have noticed as well, um, I think those ones were thinking I was going to take them out of here because they only just got put in here. You might have noticed that the sheep don't actually have wool on their back. That's because uh, the breed of sheep that, that I have uh, over generations, I've selectively only chosen for hair sheep. Um, so, big solid sheep, eat lots of grass, but don't grow wool so don't get diseases or anything like that. Organic lawnmowers that don't need shearing. Here's an idea.